don't feel like, you know, no one understands me. It's just, this is a lot of things, you know. She's going through a lot, I understand that. You know, I understand she's going through a lot, whatever. But the way she's treating me since I've been here is very unfair. It's just the frustration. Who wants to live? I mean, it's too much. I feel like dying. Just, I don't feel like living. I don't feel like dealing with it sometimes. I mean, you just go out and just chill with my friends or whatever. Yeah. She's in already? Yeah. Oh. Hi, Erica. Hello. I didn't realize you were here. I mean, I knew you were downstairs. I've been here for a while. Downstairs. And Mom is coming. Is That's what I hear. Tell me um, what's happening. Where are you? Nowhere. Uh -huh. Which means you're not at home with friends? No. You're on the street? Mm -hmm. she, she decided to keep me out so often. And she told me, don't bother coming home. I don't want to see your face. I don't want nothing to do with you. Mm -hmm. I, I, did not, I didn't want to come here today, Ruth, because I really don't want to see her. Well, I really appreciate you do you you coming. I, I really I really don't want to see her. So you're very angry with her. Huh? She has everything. Mm -hmm. you know? Maybe they're telling us that mom is there. Hello. Yeah, yeah, mom's here. Do you want to come up now? Now give me five more minutes, okay? Okay. Um, Hector and mom are here, but I just said I wanted five at least five more minutes with you, okay? Mm -hmm. What do you think will um, transpire when Hector and mom come up? I don't know. I really don't want to be here. I really feel something's going to happen. Mm -hmm. I don't want to see her right now. I don't want nothing to do with her. I'm sorry. Well, um, would it, how can we, how can we do that? Can I, um, can we make a deal that maybe you don't have to talk to her? Would that be helpful? I don't want to see her. Ruth, I don't want to see her. Hi, Ruth. I don't want to see her. Hi, Eric. Yeah. Hi. Hi, Hector. Hi, Erica. Well, I guess that it's no surprise to you that Eric is very angry mm -hmm. and very hurt. Mm -hmm. And um, that she doesn't want to be here, but she has agreed to be here. And um, which I, I think is really important and very much for her and we're going to give you some tissues Erica right um, so maybe you could tell me how things are going Erica's not changing at all mm -hmm. she what came she because you know Erica mm -hmm. she's in the house for a little while and she goes out and comes back two days later and then mm -hmm. she starts arguing with her mother like always mm -hmm. My mother says not to go hang out with the fellow, with, the, with her friends that smoke, you know, mm -hmm. that smoke or get high and, and whatever the case may be. But she, she's determined to hang out with them anyway. Mm -hmm. well, yeah. What I have to say is they don't even know who I hang out with. They're not mm -hmm. in my life like that. Mm -hmm. Who they you hang know, out with, they don't, they don't know who I'm hanging out with. Who you hang out with, Erica? Mm -hmm. So how could they tell me who do you hang I'm out around with, this, I'm around that, when they're not there to see Didn't that? Didn't you call your mother and say that you was mm -hmm. hanging out in some, in some place that they were smoking, so you was afraid that the smoke might get into your system or something like that? Didn't you? You know? Didn't so, you? Mm -hmm. What? No, I didn't call my mother and tell her nothing like that. Okay, you didn't tell her. Okay, good. That's just another gossip in the family. Okay. Whatever. But who cares? Because when I'm kicked down the street, regardless of where I stay, if they smoke crack, I gotta stay there because th that's the only place I can stay that's right now. That's where you Who's put cool? yourself. You because know. that's where you put yourself. Don't make me go there because I've had about all I could stand. So I'm trying not to say anything because I've had about all I could goddamn stand. Oh, well. I know everyone you hang out and I know everything that you do. No, you don't. And you're called up this morning finding out if I was gonna be here. Erica, you can come home today. Stay in the street. 
Well, then you stay in the street. You stay where you feel most comfortably at. Because in my house, you are not going to kick doors. You are not going to break things. And you're not going to fight with your older sister. You're not. Bottom line. So if you want to come home under those conditions, you're welcome to come home. Okay, and that's really pretty clear. What would your ideas be? Home. But I don't want to be there. But if you were, how what? No. How would it's you not be? if I were. If I didn't, I, I'm not going. I'm never. If, I'd rather stay in the street. I don't care. I'd rather stay in the street. It is hard for Erica to be there, but she came back from Job Corps. Even though I told her mother not to bring her back because it was too early. You're right, Hector. She hasn't been in the program that long. It would have been very I, I, I think easy it would have for been, her I think it to would pick have, up smoking again. I think it would have been much better. That's I, not the point. I, 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 this is my opinion. It's on you. Yeah. It's on well, okay. you. It, it has nothing to do with the program. Uh, I, I don't know. I yeah. haven't been up they there. They sell so. weed up there. You can get weed up there. You can get liquor up there. You can get everything. Every, this is America. Hello. There's drugs everywhere. Right. Everywhere. It's on you. Mm -hmm. If you want to stop. Mm -hmm. Why do you want to stop? So I don't have to see her face again. Mm -hmm. Okay, your mother loves you a lot. Believe me, she cares a lot about yeah. you. The only yeah. thing is that you continue doing yeah. the same thing all over and I all over you, again. Jean, it's a process that, that you're going you to do. Mother? It's every time you do it. You're always doing the same thing all over. She has tried to help you in a lot of ways. And I don't think it's you're seeing it as, 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 as help. Like hell. And, and that's the problem. But she does care. Mm -hmm. Well, it's hard to see things when you're hurt. And Mom right now is hurting a lot. You know, I, I'm remembering things that are going through my mind. I'm remembering one of our very first sessions here where we talked about the family yearning for connectedness, yearning to be close again because so much separation, so much heartbreak, so much disappointment uh, was a part of your life before mother went into treatment and before you came home and the two of you and that it was such a precious dream that you could be together. And so I'm wondering what happened to that dream, that yearning. I'm going to go out and see the team for a few minutes, okay? And I'll be back. Let's do this real fast and get in there and just okay. don't leave them I, in here for, an, I just for too want, long. Because I'm feeling a little pressured because yes. she has nowhere to go. Yes. The, the mother yes. that is taking her in wants her out. Mom doesn't want her in the street. And Erica doesn't want to go home if they are under this kind of tension. Can they come up with a plan as a family, as the best place for her to stay for the next few days? Is it hot in there? Is it just here? No. Wait, maybe you need a little space now. Do you need a do, uh, so you think I ought to do the family plan in session rather than sending them home? I'm going to work. So, um, if Erica were to go home, you would maybe need to talk to Amanda and yeah, say, hey, I would do. look. Right. Mm -hmm. Hello. I think that you could say some of us really feel that they're very similar and they do need to cool off. Knowing them as we have, when they cool off, they do better. Okay. Okay. The team just, you know, wanted for me to share, you know, what some of their feelings are right now. And, and they feel that, that you can figure out a place where it's safe. Mom really wants you to come home. Um, and I suspect that Erica really wants to come home. That's where she's going to end up. Uh -huh. And she if you can, go, you know, families fight. Families fight. Mm -hmm. Families hurt each other. Um, and to find a way to get out of that hole, so to speak, that we dig for ourselves is very important. And you both, you're very much alike, mm -hmm. which I think attests to I think that's a compliment for you both. 
<laughs> Listen, I trust you guys. You're going to figure this out, okay? And it's going to be safe, and it's going to be family, and it's going to be close and loving. I'll see you okay. next week. All right. Okay. Next week. Next week. Okay. <sighs>